we are really pleased to bring you part one of our interview with Joey Mulland of Badfinger. I'm John Bowden. This is Rock History Music. Joey was part of the classic lineup of Badfinger, a band that had a lot of bad luck, bad management, just bad circumstances. They were literally cheated by their manager in the U.S. When you look up bad strikes for bands, you'll find Badfinger. Here's part one of our exclusive interview with Joey Mulland. What was your reaction when you found out he passed? I was absolutely stunned. I was absolutely stunned. Uh, I think it was Tommy who called me. Uh, I was living in LA uh, at that time. And, uh, I was absolutely stunned. I couldn't believe it. He had everything to live for. He had everything to live for. Uh, but I think, um, and I don't really know uh, why he passed, why he did what he did. Uh, you know, I don't think anybody can guess about that. But, um, I think I understand, uh, you know, what brought him to that point. You know, he 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 made a lot of decisions, uh, and, and they weren't all the best. They, they really they really weren't, and uh, they led to other things happening. Um, and I'm sure those things might have weighed on him. Uh, but I was stunned. I had no. It's like just going into another baby. You know. Uh, he, he, you know, of course he did do that that night. He got very drunk. Uh, um, I don't know. I just don't know. I don't, I don't have that inside me. Uh, you know, I don't have that gene uh, that makes me think along those lines. Joey, when things were going bad with Stan and and it, the money wasn't coming in, there wasn't a part of you that ever thought, well, what's the, because you're not wired that way, right? You're not wired to, to do that kind of thing. People are different, right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly, exactly, yeah. Uh, my my instinct was, well, there's no point in staying there. Because you know, the band was fractured then, you know? And a band is like an egg. You know, they, there's only the people inside that egg know what's going on. You know, but that was fractured. And we were still to argue and, and, you know, not agree with each other, you know? Someone had asked me to ask you about, you know, you, you have a bunch of songs and you send them uh, to Mark, uh, how far back do some of these new songs go? Oh, they, well, I wrote Shine uh, for one of the, the Bad Finger albums. You know, I, I had a demo of it. We recorded it, actually. Bad Finger recorded it back in the day. Uh, we never put it on a record. Um, I don't know if our version's ever been released. Uh, it's not quite the same as the new version, but uh, that was just one of the songs that Mark picked. Uh, that's why it's on there. That, that, the fans are going to love hearing that. They're going to love hearing that story. That, that means a lot to them. Yeah, the fans know a lot, a lot of this stuff, really. They really do. They've been so supportive. There have been some, some bad things that have been said by people, but, uh, but the majority of the fans have been just great. Uh, boy, I hope they like this new album. We'll have details on Joey's brand new album coming out where you, by the way, can pre-order it. There's links at the very top of the description of this video. Make sure you comment on our video, subscribe to our channel, and share our video, and buy one of our t-shirts. I was wearing it during the interview. It helps support our channel. This is Rock History Music. Mm -hmm.